Stay a while and listen. Hello, welcome to the Freak Show. Bumpy McSquiggums here. I want to thank you all for joining me as I start my early access coverage of The Waylanders. It is by Gato Studio and it releases into Steam Early Access on June 16th, 2020. A big shout out and a thank you for sending a code my way in order to play, check out, cover, showcase the game. All right, I have not actually done anything at all yet in the game. I played around with some of the settings on the opening menu there. And we're about to figure it all out, I suppose. All right, we got male and female choices. Okay. Oh, okay. Uh, unexpected. <laughs> we have a, a few different races available, it seems. We have human. We have the wolf of wares. We have the Morian. And we have the semi-fomorian. Interesting. I'm not going to focus too, too much on character creation and all that stuff right now. I often do. I spend a lot of time reading with the various different things through all of the various different, you know, classes and races and all that stuff. I'm just going to kind of glance through real quick and just see. I guess I'm going to go with, um, let's go with this guy, the semi-fomorian. All right, so we have a warrior class. We have a guardian class. Okay, we have a rogue. We have a ranger. There's a sorcerer and a healer class. Interesting across the board. I kind of like the idea of the warriors like frontline smushing stuff with their giant weapons. Ah, that's what we're going to go with. Giant smushy weapon person. And the background is we're, we're a slave apparently. All right, let's do it. Uh, we get to kind of customize the look of our character. Interesting hairstyles. All right. What's this one? He's he's a, he's a little bit uh he got a little bit of hair in the back, but not a lot on the front. A little bit on the sides. All right, hair color. We're gonna go with dark brown. Facial hairstyle. Kind of like that, I guess. Uh, sure, we'll stick with it. We go, we go with the brown. Actually, let's go with something different. Why do we have two white? Well, one's like a grayish white. All right, let's, let's do that. There we go. Skin tone, we could be like a weird peachish color. A little bit of red, a little bit more red, a little bit of green, or whatever that is. Let's go like super red. We're angry. And then what eye colors do we have here? Did he just pick his nose? I feel like he may have. I'm not really noticing the eye color change. Are you guys noticing that? Okay, that was a little bit of different. Okay, okay, okay. I see. It. Yellow eyes. Yeah, that seems terrifying. I'm gonna have nightmares later. How about you guys? All right, we have eight attribute points or attribute points that we are able to go and throw into folks. It looks like this is our basic generic start of a warrior class. I can only assume. Brute force, uh, immunity, and intimidation increases resilience. Yeah. All right, we can only max out as as far as ten. Uh, we're gonna go nine there. Agility, eh. perception. Probably go a little bit with perception. I don't like being super low in any one particular stat. Determination, readiness, tenacity, increase speed, and cooldown, willpower. Willpower seems like it could be useful. How about we go one less on the HP type situation and we go with a little bit more into willpower. So, fives across the board, and we have a seven, an eight, and a ten. I'll, I'll live with that. That's cool. Um. He, she, they. Interesting pronouns there. Okay. Uh, our name is not Kellos. It's Kellogg. I can spell. No. Um, it's Kelly. No. Um, let's see. Who are we going to make this individual? I think if I were to pick a name, of course, we're going to have to go with a Gus name because it's just good. We're going to call him Ovaltine Jenkins with a J. There you go, Ovaltine Jenkins. I'm sure that's how you spell it. I have no idea. Uh, voice. What? All right, I guess we're going with the big, the big first dude. You are half Fomorian. Yeah, we are. Oh, we can toggle our helmet. Let's see. That. Wait, what? How is that a helmet? That's not a helmet. That's a little bit, like, we just have, like, 
a piece of dough on her face. Well, what is that? That's fine. Alright. The Adventures of Ovaltine Jenkins is about to begin. Hopefully you're all on board for this. Yeah, this has been on my list for a while. Uh, something I wanted to check out. I've been, I've been waiting and waiting and waiting. And then all of a sudden, surprise! I'm like, oh, uh, okay. So, really cool. I get to hop in and check out the game and see what it's all about. Showcase it a little bit to you guys. And then, you know, once it comes fully out, we'll hop in and begin a complete Let's Play of it. We'll see if I can actually finish one of these. Uh, I think the last one I finished that would be similar to this in any way would be Sword Coast Legends. I got pretty far in the... Pillars of Eternity first game didn't quite finish it so I will one day I'm promising you guys it's going to happen but then we have tyranny and a bunch of other stuff that we gotta go through but for now we're focused on the Waylanders think he's gonna speak I don't think he's gonna speak oh it's like is that me? To rise, oh. My king. oh always nice is there anything you need no, no. I've, uh, I've been looking forward to this day my entire life. The moment I finally meet the Twatha Dadana. The moment we finally blend our worlds into one. As have I. Though you might have to stop me from putting my foot in my mouth. Meeting my gods, my heroes, it's a lot to take in. <laughs> you don't have to do any of the talking. Or convince them to treat me like an equal. That's my job. For that, I am grateful. Are the others awake? That new soldier woke even before me. The others are beginning to stir. What about That's right. I'm woke. Do you want an honest this. answer? Or, um... He's fast asleep, isn't he? He didn't go to bed until about two hours ago. I'm pretty certain he's still drunk. Oh. I asked you to guard him. Watch over him. I know, but... Perhaps the prince should remain here on the ship during our negotiations today. Then how Perhaps will he indeed. learn? Well, not from you, I suppose. Yeah. Ouch. Oh, Fair look, it's me. Back. I'm coming Ouch. over. What's up, guys? How long have they been here? The whole time. So. What, what's this happen? How do you feel about meeting the gods today? Oh, I'm, I'm okay with it. I'm excited to be here. Honestly, I'm nervous. Just here to do my job. My feelings about this didn't don't really matter. I'm here to protect you, my liege. Strictly and professional. I'm excited to be here. <laughs> That's the spirit. I'm right here with you. Yeah. I came up here in the first place to ask if your majesty wanted some breakfast. Not just yet. Allow me a few more moments alone to enjoy the stars on the horizon before the sun washes them away. But of course, my lord. I'd be so Shall sick. We? I don't do boats well. Yeah, sing it, brother. I'm going to have to sing too soon. The Waylanders. Yeah. I'm here for it. I'm pretty excited. Cheese it's so great to snack on when you're up late. See, I can do it. I can do it just as good as he can. Maybe close. All right. And now, thanks Ooh, to my hard work, I'm shame. the youngest leader of the Druids College ever. Yep. Yes, Amagin, we know you ship rainbows. Woo! Stop bragging to the new kid. But not all of us have had thousands of years to perfect our craft. You're right. Some of us learned to shut up before we turned 30. Eh. Be nice, my dear. The sun hasn't even risen yet. I like it. Mm, yeah, because nighttime is when no one ever does or says anything naughty. You're insufferable. I love you too. Sustenance has arrived. Uh oh. I Ooh. Oh, thank goodness. I am positively famished. I love this. You ate more than anyone else at dinner last well, night. Don't worry, I'll say that. I it all off. Okay. Egg time. Yum. Oh, we have to wake oh. up the prince eventually, yeah. but he's not going to be happy about it. So just... Nope. Laid into an egg. Absolutely not. Hmm? Mm -mm -mm. Uh -uh. Don't look at me. 
All right, with my amazing helmet, I'll go do it. All right, journey to Innisfail. All right. Oh, this is cool. All right, I'm here for it. I'm here for it. What do I need to do? Do I have to talk to people? What's up? Hello? Hello? Right click? Right click. How you doing? I heard the Druid College has an enormous library. I've lived there since I was a kid. Oh, yes, I could go on about it forever. It's my favorite place. Where'd your I was drink found go? to have talent and brought there to study. Imagine all the smartest people in the world, all in one place, all trying to get smarter. Everyone devout, excited, hungry for knowledge, power. It's exhilarating. And now they put me in charge. It's almost too good to be true. Yeah, that's cool. What do you think of uh, Na Nazhedya? We like giving each other a hard time, and she can be overly dramatic for my taste, but I respect her. I've learned a lot from her, and I know there's far more she could teach me. Indubitably, yes. Yeah. All right, let's not do this. Let's go get into trouble. How do I get out of this? Hello? Ah, like that. Sweet. Click here to enter the codex menu. No, I'm good. So, you think the prince is in here? Oh, please. We're having a nice chat. Wait a little bit before awakening him. What am I supposed... Oh, oh, I gotta talk to everybody. Hey, dude. What's up? Where are you from? And what brought you to Kaltia? Are you here f for your fighting abilities? You seem fond of your muscles. What? Why? Who says that? Probably the greatest place in the world. Greece. All right. Uh, what brought you here? All true heroes need to go on a life-changing journey. Why is he so quiet compared to the like last Odysseus. guy? In order to grow, we must leave our homes and face unknowable dangers. This is my quest. Don't get me wrong. I am already a hero, but, but I could use a better story than history, please. That's fair. That's fair. Anyway, guys, guys, I want to reiterate once again, this is getting ready to go into Steam Early Access on June 16th, so it's not even at that stage yet. And don't, don't, you can't judge it too harshly on, you know, them having some placeholder stuff here and there. You know, it's, it's fine. It's fine. All right. Let's talk to Taliesin. I think that's how you say that name. Oh, uh, you and Nazhida seem close. We don't know each other that well. I'm a middle-aged widower, and she's a beautiful woman with more knowledge than I could acquire in 20 lifetimes. We've met up dozens of times over the past few years, but never really talked about it. Oh, yeah? I'm just glad to get to spend time with her. I'd be glad if my left shoulder didn't feel like it was out of place. It's fine. Uh, okay, um, and where are you? F are you here to represent the military? Well, I, I've been an archer and a general for the king for over a decade. My speciality is in planning and spotting traps. We're not expecting any funny business, but just in case... I should be able to take care of it. Well, that's fair. All right. Uh, what do you think of the prince? Lugade? He's a kid. People have started writing him off as a possible ruler, but what is he? 19? He has time. He's smart and he's kind. Okay. Oh, he'll grow into a king one day. I have faith in him. Well, that's nice. All right. Well, I'm done talking with you, so I'm out. Deuce, deuce. All right, funny lady, talk to me. I've heard that seers can gaze into the future. We're all so fabulous and stunningly attractive. I personally sure. am unusually skilled at magics, lost to all but the most educated of Morians. Because my skills in the negotiation and persuasion departments are, shall we say, oh, no, I'm not going to be humble about this. I'm a damn good talker. Fair. I hold a high position in Morian society. Oh, okay. Uh, are all seers, uh, like kings for the Morians? Oh, my dear. Kings die. I last. Fair. I've watched nearly a hundred generations of human rulers. I exist on a scale beyond your comprehension. No kidding. Hundreds or thousands? Oh, okay. Uh, who exactly are the Morians? Morians? We're the best. We're the best. If I mean, that's not true. We mostly live underground, in the dark, so that's not the best. We are immortal and do have a lot of gold, though. So, 
that's fun. <laughs> Are you here for your future sight abilities? Not just that. I check so many necessary boxes. I'm a powerful sorceress. I know more about the Tuatha than the entire Druid Is this combined. I'm an important representative of the Morian culture. And I'm charming as fuck. Is that Losa? I feel like that's Losa. I gotta have to look that up. She sounds like Losa from Divinity Original Sin 2. Okay, well that was something. Alright, let's go wakey wakey the uh, princey. Hey Prince, what's up buddy? Time to wake up. I'm I'm knocking on your archway because of reasons that I don't understand. Your Highness, Prince Lugade. If he ruined my favorite cloak, I'm gonna feed him. Ah, a go easy on him, Amagin. Maybe he'll be better at holding the throne than holding his liquor. At his age, I was already an established professor. We already uh -oh. know you're a freak. No need to brag. Has yeah, to be bragging is my thing. Everyone, we're here. Sweet. Uh oh. Uh, you guys don't see anything. There's nothing going on on the screen. It's totally fine. The deck of the arbiter. Our scouting boats have finished surveying the beach. We should be safe to land. But it's strange. There were no people to be seen. They're not exactly people, until they saw. They're gods. I know. Our gods. But do they not walk on the ground? Do they not bend twigs when walking past trees? Hmm. What do you mean? There's nothing. Nothing at all. I'm done with this. Just happened? You fucking imbecile! Father, why are we giving them presents? You're the king. They should be giving tribute to you. We are emissaries of peace to a people more powerful than any of us can understand or even imagine. This is a privilege. Well, I'm sick of privilege. <sighs> so are we. <laughs> Excuse me? Sorry. How's that hangover, your highness? I can't believe you made me share a cabin with this. This. Speak, child. What am I? Enough! Whoa! I have done everything in my power, both as your king and as your father, to prepare you to carry the crown. You're an adult now, and your mother and I, we don't know what else we can do. When we return home to Galicia, Galicia. I'm calling together the council. We need to decide if you're ever going to be suited for the throne. But father... From now on, you will address me as your majesty. Ooh... Stop gawking and get back to work. Yeah. Wait, what's happening? Are we going to talk to King Ith? Is that his name? And then the prince. Alright, so the king's probably over here. I'm so... I can't wait to see how this game actually plays, plays. This is great. This is so cool. Alright, what's up, man? Uh, do you need help preparing for the negotiation? I need some time alone to think. Center myself before I meet my gods. I must focus on what lies just ahead, instead of dreading conversations necessary when we return home. My wife is going to hate this. Yeah. Are you okay with, after what happened with the prince? I didn't enjoy a single moment of that, no. It's the hardest thing I've ever had to do, but I had to do it. He's so quiet. You did the right thing, man. Thank you. I'm not sure I did, but what's done is done. My wife is Scotta and I, we were never able to have more children. Lugade is so precious to us, we've shown him as much love as we know how. And now this. If I can't be a good father, maybe at least I can be a good king. You're fine, buddy. Uh, alright. Cool, I'm gonna go talk with the prince. Hopefully you're cool with that. Uh, is this the prince over here? It's a little bit... A little bit slow. It's okay, though. There's settings for that, I just don't have it set the way I'd prefer it here. Uh, things seem to, like, a little bit tense with your father there. I'm humiliated. How dare he? Yeah, yeah. Suck it up, princess. I am his son. Does that mean nothing to him? Why can't he accept that I'm trying my best? Um, he knows you're trying. Does he, though? You really think so? Wow. You're not 
drunk here right now. Things seemed a little tense. Uh, do you actually want to be the king? It's never mattered what I wanted. It's my birthright. Or whatever. Mother never shuts up about it. <laughs> I've always had to be the prince. Whether I liked it or not. Now our majesty is throwing it in my face. Asshole. Well, I mean, dude, you, you know, you're getting drunk and passing out. I mean, you, you need to step up your game a little bit, buddy. Okay, uh, what am I doing? Return to my cab. Well, I don't want to go back to my cabin. Alright. I love that I just have this big, big rock on a stick. That's my... Is this my cabin? I guess so. There's like a little picnic table up on top. And an evil raven. The raven of the purple eye. Fear the purple eye of the raven, for it shall spell your imminent doom. Or something along those lines. I don't know. Innisfail or Fale or some crazy thing. The Island of Destiny, I think it said. I suppose we'll figure it out. Dialogue. Stay with me, my king. I need more, Amagin. We can do better than this. What's happening? How dare you tell me what to do after embarrassing me in front of the Tuatha? Oh, the Tuatha that just attacked us. Those Tuatha, huh? Yeah, I'm a wretched bitch for dimming their esteemed opinion off you. Can't believe myself. You should be ashamed. Or, or not. What's happening? Oh, they look hungry. Brothers! Help! In terrible distress. Help. Oh no, this is gonna be a disaster. Oh god. Um. Uh huh. At least it locks the can. Okay. Am I going this way? It looks like I'm going this way. Ha! Uh, eh. Ah, you gonna hit me? Leave me alone! I don't want none. Please don't hurt me. I'm a delicate flower. All right, I'm not a delicate flower. I lied. Fool. That was great. Oh, it's, it's a little bit like I do have something I'm running right now that I don't normally have to run, and it's maybe cause it's maybe causing me a little bit of a extra lag and stuff. So I apologize if anything is stuttering or feeling super laggy. It's probably my fault. Not necessarily. What's over here? Oh, he's using my Herculean strength that I clearly have. Was oh, that the prince? Help, let me just pick this up and pick my teeth with it. Uh. Oops, I've caught your ankle in it, sorry. You. Now let's crush these Oh, bosses. and you're just fine. You just, okay, okay. Alright, buddy. Uh, well, I already did that, so... Oh, you're, you're hanging out with me now. Alright, sweet. Is there a is there an auto target button instead of having to click on fools? Cause I'd like that. Ooh, what this? A, a delicious tentacle. Oh, okay. Well, I mean that is an odd choice of food to be sure. Suppose we're going this way. All right. Well, so far I'm, I'm digging this. This is nice. This is cool. I hear nasty voices. So wait a oh oh god all right looks like I, I auto uh, attack or auto targeted somebody oh my god they're chucking stones at us ow eh. Oh, we have a oh we have a tactical pause. Oh, that's awesome. Okay, I wasn't sure that was a thing. Ah, ah! Hit him! Oh my God, there's so many things happening. Yeah. 
There's more? There's so many things. Like, you know how much loot I left behind? There's so much loot that I left behind. I, I need to go back and pick it all up. So, so what's going on down here? What was, what was all that? Do we have like rage or something? Is that what that was? Oh, well, looks like there is quite a bit of stuff that we left behind. All right. Oh, I just. Did, did, do I do I automatic? Is there is there a pick up all button? No. Oh, we got a balanced one handed sword. That sounds cool. All right. Well, let's see what that does. Very interesting. Got equipment, we got abilities. I can't imagine that this is going to be better than what we're using right now. Uh, okay. I don't understand what that means. Six and nine. This is nine and six. Tuition and logic plus three minus. Is that better than what I'm using? Is it worse? Can I do do I not have abilities that work with that? Strike. Like that's there. Well, we got another dude on our on our party now. Who who does who's this guy? Oh, I can choose him too. Oh, that's cool. He's like an archer guy. Alright. That's neat. All right, so like a like a little bit of a different perspective from your classical CRPG, with a more of a kind of a third person view, as opposed to the top down isometric view. It's interesting. It changes a lot, actually. Being surrounded by fur bulgs, uh, I don't know where they're coming from, but something. Help me organize the troops. This is chaos. On it, you help us. Uh, do we do uh, fine? Press on him to select him. Press on tell tell. Okay. Uh, why do, why would I want to do that? Oh, that's Hercules. Oh, there he is. Okay. Uh, press on the other party portraits to add them to the formation. Oh, you right click. Okay. Oh, that's interesting. Press F or click the formation button to form. Use formation abilities to defeat the enemy. Oh, what is this? Mug them. The formation charges, knocking down all enemies in its path. Bleed them dry. The formation slashes every enemy in the specified direction, making them bleed. Blind the fools and legendary smash and grab. What? Oh, that's the greatest thing I've ever seen. Yes, no, we need to do. Hold on. Uh, we need. We need to make sure we do this right. Oh, that's so cool! That was so cool. Oh, I loved everything about what I just saw. Hello. So apparently, formations don't last forever. Okay, what, what do I need to do? Are you, are you just gonna follow me now? Is hello? Is he supposed to join? Uh, oh. Father. Oh, stop your blubbering. Uh. This is all your fault. We can yell at the kid later. Save your energy. Would you all please stop? Father. Are you still alive? Uh, not Jeez. if you keep doing that. All heavy handed, kid. We need to get the king back to the boats. Agreed. Here. You're not stable enough for me to remove the spearhead. But that should make things a bit more comfortable. There's a spearhead somewhere? Nothing about this is comfortable. Your Majesty, can you stand? Here, I'll help you. That's a bad idea. Looks like muscles help I've you. I've got you, Your Majesty. I'll carry you home. I'm all right. I can stand. I just need to go slow. Keep them off me. We can do that. 
I'm yeah, we can. The beach. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I think this is Amergen and joins your party. Select his class. He could be a sorcerer or a healer. I'm going to have Amergen be a healer. And then, are we going to get the girl? Are we going to get the Losa? What is Losa? Magical boat runes. Oh, this is so cool. I'm sorry, guys. I can't wait to play more. But that's going to have to do it for this very first episode. I'm really, really excited to continue playing this, checking it out further, and seeing what it has to offer, what it's going to do. Um, I love the the idea, the concept of essentially the same thing as like a, like a Pillars of Eternity, like I mentioned before. Uh, very similar to classic CRPGs, but from a different point of view, a different perspective. I'll have to work out some of the kinks and everything else, but this is this is pretty ambitious. I, I don't think I've seen anything quite like this before. I'm sure there are probably other games, but I, I can't think of any that I've experienced that's quite the same as this. So I'm, I'm, I'm here for it. I can't wait to see how it plays out. Hopefully you guys liked what you saw. If you did, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. There'll be plenty more of this to come. And once it comes out fully and it's fully released, I will definitely be doing some coverage of this then as well. Uh, if you want more information about the game, where to get the game, information on the developer, or any of that wonderful fun stuff, it'll all be down below in the description of the video and various links and things of that nature, just like it always is. And until the very next episode, my name is Bumpy McSquiggums. Thank you so much for stopping by The Freak Show, and I will see you later. <laughs>